fellow pilgrims and welcome to Gengo no Tabi. This video will be the first in a series that will introduce a collection of tools and phrases for initiating and continuing a conversation with the Japanese speaker you have just met. It has been my experience that even with a head full of Japanese language knowledge, you can still find yourself speechless in this situation, and that can be disheartening. So consider this series of videos specifically tooled to give you what you need to survive just such a spontaneous encounter. I don't know if this has ever happened to you, but sometimes when I decide to try and practice my Japanese with somebody I've just met, I find out that they're actually from Korea or Taiwan. Sumimasen, anato wa Nihon no kata desu ka? Sumimasen, anato wa Nihon no kata desu ka? Sumimasen, anato wa Nihon no kata desu ka? Sumimasen, Okay, now that I have determined that the person I'm speaking to is actually Japanese, I want to let them know that I'm a student of their language. Okay, I now know that the person I'm speaking to is Japanese and I've let them know that I'm a student. I want to go one step further and let them know that I'm just asking for a second of their time to practice my language skills and I'm not going to take their whole afternoon. Nihongo連中する機会が少ないので少し話してもいいですか日本語を連中する機会が少ないので少し話してもいいですか日本語を連中する機会が少ないので少し話してもいいですか there you have it. Now we've made it to Jiko Shokai. If you haven't learned how to introduce yourself or ask somebody their name, every Japanese language resource teaches that right away. Make sure you have that down. And the next video in this series will be out soon and it'll pick up right after that point. So in the meantime, please leave a comment and Benkyo Surunda Zou.